Hello everyone, welcome in. Welcome back to Soda Saturday. In this case, a tag team Soda Saturday. I have Avery with me. Hey, it's... I don't review Soda as much as I used to on my channel. Now I'm basically up to like theme all parks six now. All six flags. Roller coasters <laughs> now. Yeah, this is, really the reviews just kind of went here. But he's still willing to review Liberty Brew with me. Yeah, so I got Liberty Brew today. Honestly, I think that this is probably the best Mountain Dew label design I have ever seen. Like The label design is great. I think it's probably the best I've ever seen. In, and you've never tried it before? I've never tried it before. But I do, I love the label. Apparently, it is 50 different flavors blended into one, which I find quite interesting. I'm going to have to list. Like, Mountain Dew really has 50 flavors? I doubt that. Ah, well. Uh, all right, so I found this while I was up in my camp. Uh, and I found this in uh, Troy. So I was at the Walmart in Troy yesterday, and I found Liberty Brew. I've That's tried fine. it already, but I haven't do I haven't done my I haven't uploaded my video yet. But I'll still do my review with him because why not? Yeah. So it's gonna his review is gonna be on my channel first. Now I still do soda reviews. It's just that drink runs. It's like really rare I do them now because really it's like starting to like fall apart now, yeah. basically for my channel now. So I may consider quitting drink run at some point. Well, here is the label. We have many different parts of our country. We got the Golden Gate Bridge. We got the Eagle, which is the state, which is the country's bird. Got cacti, buffalo, Joshua trees. Oh, and look, the Statue of Liberty. Oh, and yeah, there's a Statue of Liberty on the motorcycle. <laughs> More of if it's a Honda motorcycle or a Yamaha. I don't know. Well, it's still doing the do. <laughs> yep. All right. Let's go. I can, st I smell Skittles. Do you? Nah, I smell something different. Maybe it isn't Skittles. It's, it smells like some sort of candy, though. I don't. I can't really put it my. Smells pot. like lightsabers. That's it what like it the, is. Smells like the gummy lightsabers. Now, now, I actually, been like resmelling it. <laughs> it. It does actually. It That's literally what it smells is. like the lightsaber gummies. Yeah, I, I could smell voltage with a little bit of code red and a little bit of kickstart. I smell nothing like volt. Wait, actually. A small nah, hint. not really. Not a small really hint. Bitch. It's a small hint now that I think about it. All right. Three, two, one. Hmm. Yeah, it, it smells, it, it tastes like I'm drinking gummy lifesavers. <laughs> Doesn't it? <laughs> Okay, when I first tried it, I gave it a 3.5 out of 5. I am spoiling it a little bit for you guys, but whatever, I don't care. Um, but now retrying this, this is really sweet. Mm. I've had sweeter. Try watching my last review. Like, this is probably like the sweetest aftertaste I've ever had out of like any Mountain Dew flavor. Probably because they combined 50 ones. I mean, like, I like their idea, but, like, I think they went a little overboard, I think. USA, I think, was much better, oh, probably. Oh, my God. USA was so good. USA is in my top five. I, 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 I really wish USA came back. And I don't know. I don't know if Whiteout's being discontinued or anything. I know Pitch Black is gone now. And, uh... That's sad. And, uh... They still have Voltage and Code Red, but I really hope... I, I heard rumors Whiteout may be discontinued, too, but I still see Whiteout in my area, so... I don't. You don't? No. I do. Hmm, that's weird. Maybe I'm not checking in the right places. But anyway, uh, I'm going to... I will give it a 3.5 out of 5. Maybe I'd give it more like a 4.5 out of 5 because of the sweetness. Maybe eventually I'll warm up to it and give it a re-rating like I did with all the other Dew flavors, but this is definitely so, not what I thought. I'm probably going to get this a 3 out of 5 now. Mm. I mean, I... I like their idea of how they came up with something, but... I think they went a little overboard with the 50 flavors, and I feel like it's too sweet. Yeah. So like it kind of ruins the taste a bit. I mean, if it had like, if it was like a secret, like it was like dark berry or something, then I would give them props. But uh, no, it's three, three. It's a three out of five. For me, four out of five because really, I don't really find the sweetness that much of a bother, and also because of the design artwork. Definitely. Well. I gotta admit, the design artwork is probably, like, the best artwork out of any Mountain Dew. Other than the older designs, like, 
Found his supernova had a really good artwork. In oh my yeah, opinion. great. I love those colors. But supernova yeah. and pitch black had a good artwork, and uh, revolution had a decent artwork. Uh, and uh, yeah. code red, I think the older design of code red had a better artwork than the newer design. To be honest. Yeah. Well, folks, that is our opinions on Liberty Brew. Uh, the newest exclusive Mountain Dew flavor to store shelves. Get it while you still can, because it's probably going to go really fast. And, yeah, there we go. See you around, folks. See you.